I shear in late autumn, so it's almost an April May shearing, and so my sheep when they come down here have generally been quite woolly, and weathers haven't done so well because they're grazing a salt land or a salt bush pasture, which means their water intake is higher. They tend to spend more time sitting down on damp ground, and, and I guess they're urinating more. And I've had quite a bit of pizzle strike with weathers, so I think. For my situation, having some shorn sheep would be better for grazing through the autumn. Or this last year I just used my ewe weaners rather than weathers and had no trouble at all with the flies which I'd been having in pre previous years. And I just grazed the one mob. Down here we have grazed two mobs but I have electric fencing system to uh, try and keep the mobs separated and when you've got mobs either side of a plain wire electric fence you can end up with a fair bit of mingling so I just run them as one mob and, and rotate them around and um, supplementary feeding is is also a bit tricky I haven't fathomed that one out yet completely if you're grazing a salt land pasture it's always best to have a high energy suppl supplement but I've found that by the time I seem to get the sheep to be happy on a level of supplement they just they then substitute the supplement for grazing the salt bush and, and the rest of the pasture and so this last year I've just grazed the uh, salt bush and the understory just as I would normally a, a, maybe a winter and spring annual pasture and once the understory seems to have been grazed down to a level where the you know that you're getting erosion or the sheep aren't happy I've just been moving them to the next paddock and so I've used no supplement at all this year and that seemed to be work for me a lot better I didn't have the complications of of trying to graze the pasture out and match the uh, and, and match the supplementary feeding to what I thought the sheep should be eating it just seemed to get too complicated for me so it meant that um, if I wanted um, it, it meant that I was moving the sheep on more quickly than you might um, because I was always erring on the side of caution I didn't want the sheep to go hungry but I, I was running 918 ewe wieners I, on sometimes only 5 hectare plots so that's a stocking rate around 180 DSC and, and there's the stress of you know a dense population of sheep on a site and you've got to make sure they're getting a good drink of water and uh, and that sort of thing so it was fairly intensive but I think you know I was pretty happy with it it worked so I think that's what I'll do in the future